Hello, this is Grandma's Gone Gaming. I am bringing you episode one of the March 2024 Minecraft Hardcore Challenge. It is called Berserker Gang. The seed is available on my description. We are in large biomes. Structures are on. Standard rules apply, except we have a couple differences. This is a score-based challenge where your score is equal to the number of mobs you've killed. This is tracked in the statistics menu. Standard rule 3 still applies. That rule just is the same as always. We can't harm passive mobs. Actions leading to the harm of passive mobs are also not allowed. In other words, don't throw rocks at them, you know. Non-food drops from legal deaths, i.e. wolves killing sheep, that kind of thing, may be used. Spawned hostile mobs may be killed at the player's own discretion. Neutral mobs may be killed if they stand a chance of killing you otherwise, though avoid attacking them if possible. Also, it doesn't say in there, but we can't go fishing with an axe. We can use a fishing rod to catch fish if we want to. Otherwise, you're going to be bread-based, basically. So now, there is the other rule, and that is for this challenge only, we may not equip or use any of the following. Swords of any kind, armor of any kind, a bow or a crossbow. That is not really important to me in Minecraft. I use my axe almost all the time, and half the time, if I have any armor at all, it will be leather armor. So we're going to go ahead and go back to the game here, and there we go. Hopefully, we're not going to have any problems with the recording software. It is recording, but it's a little bit... Okay, now it's wanting to move. All right, we will be needing to get wood and make a few tools. I think I, think I will make an axe and... No, maybe not. I think I will just make enough... I will make just one pickaxe. That's it. I haven't played MHC in a long time. It's like, what do I do first? Other than say hello. <laughs> so yeah, here we go. I hear chickens. They won't do me any good. I will maybe collect a few seeds because I can grow my own wheat if I need to. Although, you know, we only have eight days to do this. I'm probably going to be looking for a village. Come on. And that actually would give me more things to kill at night also. So, yeah, we'll we'll do a little bit of extra stuff here. I don't want to... Those, we must be in the old growth. I'm using Batty's cords down here, so I'm not seeing what's on the F3, and I don't want to take the time to look right now. But I'm pretty sure, because otherwise all of the birch trees would only be eight. Well, would not just only be... They would not be taller than eight squares tall so these some of these are so it must be the old growth i'll take a look here in just a second okay and yeah f3 whoops nope i can't do it when i've got that open silly f3 yeah it is the old growth okay so now um okay i'm gonna take i'm gonna take half of that and make those out of it. Keep that down there. I'm going to be making charcoal um, to start with to because I won't have coal until I find some. So right now we're going to stick that up there I think. I'm going to be, I usually put my sword in the number three slot but I can't use a sword so I'm going to put two of these. I usually make two and put them in number three and instead of shifting everything over to number five all the time i'm going to be using number three okay so that we'll see how that goes um you know you get so used to doing things one way <laughs> so if i do that right now and i make myself just one pickaxe like that put that in its usual slot and go ahead and pick this up All right, and then we're gonna find a hole in the ground. That one looks like it might be worth, whoa, a little bit of hesitation. Ooh, I, there's a lot of water down there. Let's see what else I can find. Um, I usually go south. We can just go that way. Can't kill cows ever in MHC, so that's nothing new. I don't know what I wanna do here. I want, oh, what's this? Is this another hole? Maybe. 
Okay. Oh my goodness, that goes down into a big area, which could be good, but not necessarily. To be. Let me get some dirt while I'm doing this. Be smart to be using my time well. Okay. That way at least I can build a shelter if I need to. That looks like a little bigger than I want to go into right now also. Oh uh, yeah, too much water. Too much Oh, is that coal over there? No, that's that's um what do you call it? Copper. Oh yeah, over there. Okay. No, 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 no. That's not what I want. Let's put this where it belongs here. Leave that there. I will be needing to get stone. Okay, so let's, yeah, we'll just go completely opposite to the way that I usually go. See what else I can find. Just, what is this? <gasps> this is perfect. I still light out here because I don't have anything. Uh, I will want to dig in, I think, so let's go this way. This is great. I hope. It doesn't matter. Oh, yeah, well, you know what, it, what will matter, but not yet. I'm going to make myself some stone tools here in a few seconds. Then I'm going to go get uh, trees so that I can have uh, charcoal. I need more logs than what I have. Come on. Just a little bit of lag because of the recording software. Which I sure hope this is going to work. I had to reset everything because I had put in updates and then the updates just were not working and actually I think I know why they were not working now because I had it set to record in mp4 mode and it always hangs up Minecraft when I do that. I didn't realize that because I had done that with something else so I would switched it back in the older version I switched it to record as AVI and then when I make my uh, when I go in and uh, um, get it ready for YouTube, I'll switch it over to MP4 there. Ta -da! When I do the editing, that's the words that I was trying for. All right, how much of this do we have right now? That's enough to make tools. Let's uh, kind of stay in this area, I think, just for the moment at least. Good. Well, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and use up that pick. And I don't have to waste it and throw it away. I can just use it for a little bit. It's slower, but it's going to be gone in just a couple of seconds. Just like that. Okay. So, yeah. We will put stay on three. I don't have to move that. Nope. Three. There we go. Right there. And make one, two. Two pickaxes. Two axes. Two shovels. Not making any swords. Two shovels. And then two of these, like that. And put that back there. Pickaxes go here, like that. That's going to stay there. It just seems very strange, but that's okay. I'm all right with that. We can live with that. We do want to go get some more trees. I may come back here and see if I can find coal right there. But the trees are right here. Thought I saw something move right there. Shouldn't be anything dangerous out here right at the moment. We'll be getting dark here pretty soon. And now what's what's gonna be interesting is we'll see if this works like it does most of the time when I get logs like this in order to make charcoal. Usually I don't have to mine very long <laughs> before I find coal. If I don't make charcoal, it seems like I can not find coal forever. So we'll see how that works. That'll be fun. It's always a f fun thing to find out in games like this where you're not allowed to uh, do everything that you are when you're just on your own. Okay, here we go. Because yeah, normally when I'm playing by myself, I go ahead and take that starter chest because, you know, I'm just playing for the fun of it. And a lot of times there's not anything in there that you can really use even in that, but you do usually get one or two pieces of food. Well, now I'm having to edit out a sneeze. I will get rid of that. You won't have heard it. 
Oh man, I had to sneeze some more, but at least I stopped the game that time, so I didn't lose any seconds. Oh man, I don't even know where that came from. Just all of a sudden, sneezing began. Alright, well, we've gotten quite a bit of cobble. That's good. I can use that. That I can use for fuel right now. Let's see if we can just maybe get down just a little bit. I don't have any lights, cause, so I can't go very far. I can make this, this, you know what, I'm going to make sure we have a secure place here. I do want actually spiders to be able to come in. And they will if there are any around. But now I can't, there won't be any other things coming after me. And now we're going to go ahead and put that down and make some furnaces. Whoops, that only had enough to make one. I was thinking there was more than that in there. There we go. I usually make at least two. All right. And one of those and put this up there. That's where I usually put it anyway. That's fine. And because it's dark, we will throw that tree in there to start with and throw in half of the logs. And as soon as we get the, we're going to need more than that. We're going to throw the sticks in. Don't lose the fire. I lost my impetus right there. I'm going to have to put one of these in too. I should have just done that in the first place. There we go. Now we can use this. And we'll go ahead and put the next one in there as well. That will do it, I believe. And then we can make some torches here in just a couple of seconds. Ready? There we go. Make four torches. Yay! Um, not yet because now I used up all my sticks. There we go. I'm just not used to this anymore. All right. Put those there. And thank goodness that the furnace when you turn it on like that does give you enough light to be safe. We'll put that there. That should be plenty. I'm hoping I'm going to do a step up here so I can kind of see around. I really do want some things to gather out here since that's the, the basic idea of this whole challenge this time. Okay, we have that. And it's going to take another one. And I can actually put more of those in anyway. So I make a couple more torches. There we go. And go ahead and make the rest of those into planks. There we go. All right. So I think maybe we'll go ahead and go down just a little bit. All right. Just to see what's around. Maybe I can find some iron, although it's really kind of hard to do that when you're going down into the ground these days. You don't get down low enough right away. Is that five? One, two, three, four, five. That's how I thought maybe it was gravel. I didn't want to get into that. Two, three, four. And five. I'm not going to go any deeper than this. Oh, I don't want that stuff, so just stay. I'm going to leave those there for the moment. I'm going to kind of maybe go another direction up here. Just check on things out here. Anybody see me? Oh, look, there's a stick that came out of the tree there. All right. Well, let's kind of go another direction for the moment anyway. Two. Three. Ooh. I don't need that. Copper. Is that five? One, two, three, four. No, one more. There we go. I'm just kind of dig around in here for a little bit. I think I heard something out there, but it may have just been the furnace. Yeah. I really thought maybe I'd be finding coal by now. Because it usually happens. But it doesn't seem like it wants to right now. I'm going to be collecting those fairly soon as soon as it gets a good way into daylight anywhere part before we that's still that copper uh more copper okay yeah <sighs> darn it don't want copper iron would be nice 
Yeah, anyway, when it gets close to, to daylight, I'll be collecting my things. It doesn't look yet. No, not yet. I'll be collecting my torches at that point. What do I want to do here? Um, let's just try going this way then. More <laughs> copper. Don't want it. It'll just take up inventory space and I'm not going to use it. Unless I, ooh, unless I come to a trail. A ruined trail thing. But I don't want to get buried underground. I'm not going to be able to find things to kill that way any good. You know? Mostly I want to stay up close to the surface, I think. Uh, getting down in some of the ravines might be good. Maybe a couple of caves. This is not doing me very well here. I really did expect to find some coal. But I think I'm just going to start collecting these. I didn't put any over there. It's going to be daylight here pretty soon. Yeah. Starting to turn a little bit, I think. Getting brighter. Not much, but hey. Um, we'll go ahead and get these. I'm going to shut these off because otherwise we'll have stuff. Well, actually that probably wouldn't be a bad thing unless it's baby zombies. So yeah, maybe we'll do that. We'll just um, just do this right here. Baby zombies can't even get past that, but other ones could. Um, creepers, yeah. That one will just shut off. Um, Right there. And go ahead and shut that off two. Not yet. Okay, well then let's dig along along here this way. What do we got here? Okay, good. We can make more more torches now. Alright. One, two, three, four. That's probably enough for a little bit. Okay. That's not enough for much, but it'll do for the moment. And that Oh, and I'll need to get more trees if I'm not finding any coal. But that's fine. Come on, find me some coal. That really does surprise me. If you've seen me doing Minecraft before, you'll know that I usually hit charcoal as soon as I... I mean, hit coal very soon after I make charcoal. This time, I did not happen to get there. Not even a s trace of any kind. Oh, no, I gotta go, what? Six. Darn it. I'm still thinking about whether or not I should use the f my regular f five key for stuff, or... <laughs> I don't know. This is different. Well, I went that way. Now what? What am I going to do? Hmm. Maybe go a little deeper on this side. Oh. Oh! There, there, there. If I'd have gone that direction in the first place. Look at that. Look at that. Yay! There we go. <laughs> I would have had it right away if I'd have gone that way. Then it would have proved out immediately. But anyway, yeah, there's coal. That's good. I can use all the coal I can get. The charcoal doesn't hurt, except then it just takes up extra inventory space until you use it up. But now I can use it up. So there. Still on day zero. We'll be changing pretty soon. Okay. There we go. Looks like maybe a little bit more here. Okay, good. All right, now let's... Uh, man, looks like the night kind of got stuck. <sighs> well... Hmm. Well, I sure, certainly have enough of this stuff, I think. Let's not try to get any more of that. All right. What are we going to do? <laughs> Look at all that. It'll come in handy. It's okay. Um, actually, we'll probably want to get a few more logs. There's my regular coal. Um, yeah, I will have to, obviously, because I'm going to have to have more sticks and all that kind of stuff. For now, we're going to make all of the charcoal 
into torches. There we go. Like that, that, and that'll keep me going for a long time. There we go. Put that one up there. And let's get rid of uh, that. I could fix it, but I'm just going to make a couple more. Oh, stop. That's not where you're supposed to be. Right there. There we go. Okay. Over here. Over here. Over there. All right. Oh, now we have light. Okay. Well, it isn't daylight all the way, so let's pick this stuff up, though. And get the torches that I have left. What is that? Oh, that was in the thing making charcoal, right? I forgot it was still going. Goodness. Why didn't you yell at me? <laughs> Would not have done any good. All right. Torches. Because I went. There we are. We're on day one. So that is the end of the first episode. And I will be back with episode number two. Thanks for watching. And bye for now.